This Week in History, in 1984, the first known newspaper ad from the original Transformers toy line offer uh, showed up. Uh, Autobot cars were eight ninety nine, which is about $19, $18 in 2015 money. And, um, oh, $10 for the Jets. And they, <laughs> no rain checks, limit two per customer, minimum 300 per store. So um, you can tell the Transformers were kind of popular. Uh, or they were going to be. Um, so if you if you haven't ever visited his blog, uh, Crazy Steve does a great job of capturing, finding, archiving, and displaying um, ads and uh, information from um, around Transformers. So like the he'll have reviews from newspapers for like Transformers the movie, and all of these uh, really neat ads. So. Here's a Diaclone ad um, from – I don't even remember Diaclone being on the shelf. Don, do you remember Diaclone being on the shelf? Um, I remember some of the Chronoform stuff from Diaclone being on the shelf, but not the uh, not the Transformer versions of them. Here's the ad, uh, Toys R Us, 8-19-1984, uh, Transformers Autobot Cars, uh, Change Cars into Robots, ages 5 and up really neat it's 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 just so weird seeing those prices and remember seeing them in store walking in imagine walking into a walmart today and seeing a a a g1 wheeljack in the box for nine dollars i mean and and you had i I remember when classics version one was about nine dollars per figure in walmart so (laughs) And this is when Don, you know, Don was walking in as a young adult, seeing these prices. Yeah, I was, I was fifteen. I started collecting in '84 when I was fourteen with Sludge, so I was there when it started. I, I make no qualms about it. I started collecting uh, in 1984 when I was five, and it was Slag, oh, Mirage, and Gears. yeah, Mirage, and I broke Mirage, and then it was Slag, and I broke Slag. <laughs> and then it was uh And then your parents started buying you GoBots because yeah, they were cheaper. That's true. Then it was um then it was of course my uh Cosmos that I got later. And I still have him to this day. I still have Gears, but he's in sad, sad shape. My Cosmos is in one piece. He's just a little bit raw. well, he's missing the wheels that were at one point attached to the bottom of um How do you lose the wheels? I was five years old or six oh. years old, yeah. Okay. <laughs> so he's like, "Why does my UFO have wheels on it?" What yeah, the hell? He doesn't need wheels. But yeah, so uh, yeah, I've been collecting that long. Uh, Diecast. When did you actually start? You weren't even born then, so I I was born in eighty two, so I I was there. I, I, was, I was two old. years old. <laughs> um, God, I I don't remember. There, there was a time when I, I, I didn't have a home, and I was kind of the the one toy. It was given to me at, by someone who probably didn't want it, and my one toy was a non-transforming vehicle Voltron, and that was my one toy for a while. Till, uh, uh, I, but I always over went over. You know, I end up over friends' houses that had Transformers, and that was always amazing to me. Uh, when I got to see theirs, so I guess that's part of the reason I collect now. I'm like, oh, I can get these now. I do want to point out, uh, it really doesn't have much to do with anything Transformers related, but the first per- the first uh, toy purchase I can ever remember making was, uh, and I-, I couldn't remember the name of it until I found it at uh, Retro Reboot in Charlotte, which if you're in the Charlotte area, I recommend going to. Um, it was an Imperial Monsters two-headed dragon. And if you're watching the video, you can see it right here. I bought that as a kid at a Roses, which was a local chain back in 1982 or so, and um, maybe 83. But that was a that was one of that, and I think I got Trap Jaw from Masters of the Universe roughly at the same time. So I can remember buying toys from the point when Diecast was born. But Don can remember shaving from the point that I was born. So. <laughs> No, no, actually, I didn't start shaving until I was like like sixteen or seventeen because I just never. My facial hair is just minimal, so I got hair everywhere else. Which mine was. 